what is going on youtube welcome back to my channel it is your boy tweezy making it look easy man man i like youtube man i'm just not getting on it man getting a hang of things and there's a lot of newcomers here joining y'all don't know who i am from a fly in the sky so this video man i'm gonna make sure Y'all get to know me as a person, man, you know what I'm saying? Just explaining how I lost my teeth and the journey along the way, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, make sure y'all go ahead and subscribe. Ring that bell, comment, like, give the video a thumbs up, because that's what we do when we like things on my feet. Say, good job. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> just hit the button. Dang. Okay, yeah, so... Y'all just stay tuned, man. I'm about to go ahead and get to it and explain the truth of Tweezy. <laughs> I'm so lame. Y'all say something. Okay, so I'm back. Let me kick back and relax. Because this is going to be crazy. I feel like I'm talking to myself, but then I'm really not. I'm talking to y'all because y'all at home. Probably in the living room, eating some Postmates or Uber Eats, or somebody gonna whip something up in the kitchen. All type of things. There's no telling, man. I hope y'all stick here with me. I feel like Mr. Rogers. I love Mr. Rogers, y'all. I feel like I'm Mr. Rogers. Mr. Rogers just talk to you. Yeah, man. I just hope y'all watch the whole video, too. And you make sure y'all comment too, cause I love reading the comments. Cause half y'all don't even know what y'all be talking about. But it's cool, you know what I'm saying? We all have our own opinion and thoughts that rotate through our minds every day. So feel free to comment whatever you like. I'm probably gonna see it, so you know what I'm saying? And I reply too, and my, and my, I respond, talk to people, I have whole conversations. So you know what I'm saying? It's lit. But anyway, okay, so this day started on my 20. First birthday, man. 21st birthday. It's crazy. I'm old now. I'm 25, bro. I'm 25. I think every day, bro, I'm old as fuck around the YouTube, nigga, bro. I don't know what's going on. I'm lost in the fall. What? Nigga, I ate some beans, trust. What you talk about, bro? What are y'all doing? I need the recipe. I need the sauce. I need it fast. But anyway, yeah, not the matter on my 21st birthday. Being crazy, intoxicated, under the influence, drinking, drinking, drinking. Crazy. Mm -hmm. 21st birthday, man. January 29th, for y'all don't know. That's my birthday. I'm an Aquarius. <laughs> Aquarius, you know what I'm saying? If y'all know what that means, you know what I'm saying? It's lit. But yeah, January 29th. At the time, y'all don't know, retired military. I was in the Marine Corps for five years. You're welcome, you're welcome, you're welcome. I know y'all like, oh, thanks for your service. I didn't know you served, Tweezy. Yes. And no a frag grenade did not go off in my face. No crazy stuff like that. So, no, that ain't what happened. So, 21st birthday, I was in the Marine Corps, man, working. Not a crazy, just regular shift. I was night crew, so I went to work from, like, 4 p.m. to, like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in the morning. It depends, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> crazy job. So, one of my sergeants at the time, I wasn't even a sergeant, I thought I was a Corporal E4 at the time. He was like, yo, it's your birthday, you know what I'm saying? I was just regular old Antoine Willie. I was tweezy, everybody knew me as tweezy, but I was like just the funny dude everybody knew. You know what I'm saying? Like everybody been telling my whole like, you funny, you funny. I'd be like, Ron, just be chilling, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> that made no sense. But, um, yeah, it's just cool. He was like, you know, I asked him to. I was like, can I leave work early? I, it's just my birthday, you know what I'm saying? 21. I just want to go, you know what I'm saying? Just leave the shot a little early. He was like, you know what, Corporal Williams? It's cool. We're going to let you leave early. But don't do anything stupid to make me regret doing this. I said, come on, son. I ain't about to do nothing, bruh. I ain't about to do nothing. I'm about to go chill at the crib. Buy a little alcohol because I'm 21. I can do that. Hold on. Yes, I have my ID. You know what I'm saying? I can do that now. So that's all I was going to do. But I knew the whole time I was about to go get lit. And you know what I'm saying? My friends. So where I stayed at, I was stationed at. Y'all probably like, where are you stationed? Where are you stationed? Um, I was in um, Cherry Point, North Carolina. It's like Jacksonville, North Carolina. Camp Lejeune. I was in like Havelock, North Carolina. Y'all know what that is. It's in the middle of nowhere. 
So I didn't have like North Carolina, but 45 minutes away was Greenville, North Carolina. And you got ECU, it's like a you know college over there. So a lot of college activities going on. I would be a fool not to take part in this. So I wound up, um, one of my Marine buddies had friends out there and a couple females he knew. So we wind up um, going out there and I met, you know, mutual friends, met them and everybody was cool. I was still Antoine, regular, you know what I'm saying? Still had my teeth in, cool. Just smooth, you know what I'm saying? And <clears throat> um, so that night for my birthday, we already planned me get off and like go out. Like, I was gonna go out. As soon as, if I would've got off at like 12, whenever I still was gonna go out. So I wound up going out earlier because I got let off of work early and drove, went to Greenville. It was my birthday. So at that time, I really didn't never drink like that. I never drank in high school and nothing like that. So <clears throat> my alcohol tolerance wasn't you know what I'm saying? It wasn't nothing. I don't know how it is. A couple shots. And so freaky. I'm sorry. I'm cold now. It's freezing in here. <laughs> so anyway, um, yeah, I had a, went over there. I wound up taking like 21 shots. It was actually like 26. And then I drunk. I was drinking Fireball and like Amsterdam. All the shots was Fireball. I know that for sure. But it was crazy, cause me when I get drunk, after I like when I feel like oh I'm lit, I'm lit, I can't feel my tongue. Like, like nothing. You can't feel, you can't even taste the liquor going. It just like it tastes like Kool-Aid or water. You don't taste it, it's not nasty no more. You just put them back like nothing, cause your tongue, I can't feel it. So my I was like, yo, my tongue numb. Anybody else tongue numb? And I was just like biting my tongue. My, I couldn't taste nothing. I was gone. So we wound up leaving. I made it. The crazy thing is, bro, I made it to the club. I was lit. I was feeling good. I got in the club, cool and dancing. I remember dancing in the club. Well, um, what was we doing? I think we were doing the nay nay. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, huh, I think I was doing a nay nay in there. Like, I was lit, you know what I'm saying? So, um, and it's crazy. This was probably the new Hassani PJ, all them folks. I knew all them, you know what I'm saying? So, I was doing a nay nay in there. And, oh, that's what happened. I was dancing. And I was like, yo, why I ain't got no, I'm looking around. Everybody got drinks in their hand. I'm like, bro, I'm 21. It's my birthday. I can buy some liquor in here, too. I, I normally, once we, Leave the club, that's it. You pre-gained already, bro. I hope you lit. Cause now that you know somebody's not gonna bring you a cup or you got a little extra chicken chicken, you're doomed. So I realized I came to the clue the conclusion I can buy my own liquor. So I go in there and get the liquor. I mean I go to the bar, I'm like, yeah, let me get um, some uh, I think I got Jack and Coke. Honey Jack and Coke. Anyway, I was getting drinks. I think I got Honey Jack and Coke, then I got some like tequila stuff. I was just messed. I don't know, you know what I'm saying? And still chilling, still chilling. So this is when everything actually comes down to a blur and my memory gets like shot. We're leaving the club and it was two girls. I don't remember their name. I don't even know their names. I, don't, I barely remember their faces. They was walking out. You know me, I'm like, bro, I can get something, you know what I'm saying? I'm cute a little bit, you know what I'm saying? I got a pretty smile. Back then, that's all I had, like a pretty smile, white teeth, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh, he, my little brother, hey, he's so cute, you know what I'm saying? Like that. But I was smooth, you know what I'm saying? I was tweed at the end of the day, so, um, well, not that day, because it didn't end well. But put my arm around these girls, we walk in, and the thing was, we were walking to the little bus stop because of college town, so you just hop on the bus and take you to your neighborhood type stuff, y'all know what I'm talking about. So, we walk in across the street, we walk in, and I put my arms around these girls, and I'm walking, and one of them was like, ew, and like flick my hand off, and then all my homeboys like, oh, oh. Then one of my friends, it's crazy because I've been doing front flips. I've been morphing into a Power Ranger since I was like six, y'all. I love the Power Rangers. Only Mighty Morphin, Turbo, and Zeo. All the rest of them is lame. But I like the Power Rangers. I always just like the Power Rangers. I, when I was little, I used to watch the Power Ranger movie, jump off the couch, do I, I the Power Rangers. Ask anybody in my family, I tell you. So 
I always did this front flip. I was always like, when I got older in middle school and stuff, I used to flip, flip like a lot. And I used to, I'm about this morphing time. And I always do the morphing time and I like run and do a front flip. But when I do the front flip, I like exaggerate it like, woo, whatever. And if you watch the Power Rangers, then you'll know when they be flipping, the, the camera view is like up and they're flipping over and making like different noises and stuff. So anyway, I um, was doing that all the time. Like people would just be like, hey, I bet you want morph. And I'm like, morph time, do nothing. And then run out of nowhere, do a front flip. So that's just like a little background so y'all know why I did a front flip. So I was, the girl had just like slung me off and like swerved me. So my boy was like, I bet you want morph on her ass though. And I was like, who want morph? She just tried me. Who ain't gonna morph? It's morph time. Shape too tight. And then I ran out to the street, bro. Did a front flip. Landed on my face. Cracked. Cracked my shit, bro. Like a morning egg. It was over. I don't remember landing the flip. I don't remember landing on my face. I don't remember, I never found my teeth. We looked for my teeth for like, they say they looked for them for like 15 minutes. So my friends had to tell me everything after this. They say when I hit the ground, boom, I sat there. I just laid there. And it was like, oh snap. And they like ran, cause I literally like, I don't know if they knew I was actually going morph, but I just did it out of nowhere. So like, y'all probably like, why they didn't help you? Why they didn't stop you? I didn't know you was drunk, but it was like, how I did it, it was quick, bro. It was just like, shoom, like I just ran off. They was like, what the fuck? And I really did it. And really what happened was, y'all seen hella videos that really explains it, but I really just ran. I use my phone. I really just ran, do, 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 jumped up like that. And then I didn't put my feet down. I over rotated and then smattered that. From here down to there. From my nose right here to there, I fractured my jaw. Fractured it. That was, it was bad, bro. It was so sad. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. Landed on my face. And then um, my friend said I sat there. And then they came up to me. When they came up to me, I turned around and I was smiling. Like I was laughing. And that's how they seen my teeth was out. And it was like, oh. And they said they picked me up off the ground. My three teeth, they not like smooth, clean out. Like, like they was out of there. No chip, no nothing. Then chip, they smooth. So they three came out. My bottom four. I brush my teeth today for I get up close. My bottom four, the them four, was pushed back into my mouth. So they pushed back. My friends say when I got up off the ground, I reached in my mouth. Cause I guess I was like trying to talk, I couldn't cause my stuff was pushed back literally. So um, I reached in there and I pulled them back into place, like pulled them up and then went into the sup dogs. For all y'all, y'all know what sup dogs are, if y'all go to Green Easy, whatever. I went to the sup dogs bathroom and then there was, I was like, dang, should I go to, I think it was like, we gotta take you to the hospital, we gotta take you to the hospital. So then they wound up taking me to the hospital. I don't remember going there now. I remember waking up. And I was in the hospital, and it's the girl Janet. Janet, ja I remember Janet. Janet, if you see this video, I remember you, Janet. You was a little nice little Mexican or Italian. It was spicy though. I wanted to crack your back, but I couldn't. But yeah, Janet. Janet was the one I think who drove, and she made sure I was good in there. And when I woke up, they was like, "Bro, you knocked out your teeth. They was gone." I was like, "Where they at?" I was still drunk, but they didn't find my teeth. They were looking for my teeth for like 15 minutes. Them things vanished into the Earth's atmosphere because they went nowhere around me. So they didn't find my teeth, so that's why I ain't got them. So when y'all ask me where my teeth at, I don't know. And if you come across them, let me know. Cause I'm not trying to get these veneers be walking around butt to Billy, you know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to do that. So if y'all do find them, let me know. I'll put my contact information where you can get this resolved. Um, but yeah, so, yeah, and then after that, it was just sucky, bro. Like, it's crazy because, like, when I knocked him out, I didn't talk to nobody. Like, the only people that knew at my, oh, that's, I left out a part, y'all. I freaking, um, my sergeant, I had to call him when I was in the hospital. 
and I called him, it was like three o'clock in the morning. And first thing he said was, what'd you do? And I said, I knocked out my teeth. And then he was like, oh, come to the shop. I went to the shop, they thought I got beat up. They thought I got stumped the F out, literally. But yeah, that's a whole nother story. But yeah, man, that's really how I knocked it out. Just being foolish, so yeah, man. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Time for me to wrap it up, you know what I'm saying? Like a Trojan. Um, and yeah, make sure y'all subscribe, ring that bell, comment, like. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. A little quick song, you know what I'm saying, for y'all folks. Just so y'all can know me. But hey, y'all go check out some of my previous videos, you know what I'm saying? And y'all start seeing some of my content more, so yeah. Catch y'all. <laughs> They calling me handsome. <laughs> Hold on, I ain't ready to leave y'all yet. <laughs> five bars, five seconds. Nah, no, just fine. All right, bye. <laughs>